Every year, species disappear forever. The brutal truth about nature is, once you're gone, that's usually it. No second chances. Or so we thought. Life, uh, finds a way. Whether it's humans playing God or some divine miracle, here are five species that already came back from extinction. And trust me, some of these will blow your mind. Let's start with one of the most talked about names in recent conservation history, the dire wolf. Now yeah, I know what you're thinking, every YouTuber under the sun has already told you they're just hybrids, they're not the real deal. But even if they aren't 100% genetically pure, this is still huge. Why? Because it proves it's possible to recreate extinct or endangered species using modern science. And as someone who's worked with animals, I've seen it time and time again, people only seem to care when a species is already gone. But if a so-called fake resurrection can help spark interest in saving species like the red wolf, then I say resurrect away. But the jury's still out on this one. What's your take? Are these real enough to count? There's no ifs, buts or maybes on this one. The scimitar horned oryx was once extinct in the wild and conservation brought it back. In 1900, there were half a million across North Africa, but by 1980, just a few hundred remained, wiped out for meat, fur and their horns. This is where conservationists stepped in. Some were placed into breeding programs and thank God they were, because in 2000, they were declared extinct in the wild. But here's the twist. By the year 2000, zoos and sanctuaries already had thousands, ready for phase two, release. 25 oryx were released into Chad as a founder population, and less than a decade later, there were over 600 living wild again. They're now endangered, which yeah, might not sound great, but it's a hell of a lot better than extinct. This next one is a fish so mental looking you'd think it's from another time. And you'd be right, the coelacanth, aka the living fossil, was believed extinct for 70 million years. In 1938, Marjorie Courtney Latimer, a South African museum creator, spotted something strange in a fishing net, an ancient species long thought lost, and scientists confirmed it. The coelacanth was back. Really? You are you really here? You know it, baby. But here's the wild part. 60 years later, another coelacanth turned up in a market half a world away in Indonesia. That's right, two living species, both thought extinct, just chilling in the ocean like nothing's ever happened. What is happening right now? Sadly, both are now vulnerable again. Thanks to being rediscovered, they've gone from accidental bycatch to scientific trophy hunting. But how wild is that? Imagine surviving the dinosaurs and nearly getting wiped out by a fishing net. Found only in the Grand Cayman Islands, the blue iguana is a scaly survivor. Once common, they crashed thanks to, take a guess, yeah, humans. Hunting, roadkill and invasive pets, by the year 2000, just 30 were left in the wild. Technically, they were never officially declared extinct, but when a population's that low, it's what's called functionally extinct. Basically, it's game over if we don't intervene. Luckily, local facilities started collecting eggs and rearing babies in captivity, and when ready, they were released into the wild. Get this, over 1,200 have now been released. In just 25 years, this species has been pulled back from the brink of extinction and is now absolutely thriving. Had you heard of this species before? I'd love to know how many of these animals are new to you. Did you know, back in 2011, an animated film accidentally predicted the future? You might know it, Rio. Starring a rare blue bird. That's the Spix macaw. And at the time of the movie, it only existed in captivity. Deforestation and the illegal wildlife trade hit hard. There had been no sightings since 2000. And by 2019, it was declared extinct in the wild. That's a big wait hoping for a sighting, but if they'd have just waited a little longer, they wouldn't have had to go through the effort of changing it on a website. Just three years later, in 2022, 20 birds were released into the wild, and they've bred successfully. A once lost species is now free flying again. So there you go, five animals who came back from the dead. Some thanks to science, some just pure luck. But all a reminder, that extinction doesn't always have to be the end. Which one of these stories hit you the hardest? 
comment your favourite comeback below, and while you're there, hit like, subscribe, and share this to a loved one, preferably not an extinct one though.